I'm Mark Tewart and thanks for tuning in to our video series, Why Do Automotive Dealerships Struggle? In video number eight, we're going to talk about low expectations. In video number seven, I talked about having very clear expectations, but there's a component of that that goes along with that and that's in this video series, Higher Expectations. You will find if a dealership or any business on earth is doing well, they have raised their thinking. They have raised and changed their belief system. And along the way, they've gotten people to buy in to those higher expectations and change their belief system. And here's what happens when you change your belief system. In other words, if you fake it till you make it sometimes, you're going to find that eventually what happens is you change your reality. In all struggling dealerships, they have made their reality to be there's only so many sales. There are only so many things they can do. There's only so many things they can do to compete against a strong competitor. There are only so many dollars they have. You name it. No matter what area it is, there's a way around it to raise the expectations, but you're going to find professional victims. You're going to find in struggling dealerships people that are continually allowing the outside world to dictate their inner world and what's going to happen. You're going to find people that have made excuses and made that their reality and lowered their expectations. They do not believe you can make gross profit. They do not believe you can make profit or sales. And you know what? They are right. Whatever they believe will become true. But yet, right across the street is always in that town another dealership with the same exact scenarios with a totally different belief system and expectations that immediately does superior. And I'm not talking about a little bit, I'm talking about a lot. If you're going to work this hard to try to go in and make a living and make sales and do all the things, why not reach much higher than you ever had before? You're going to find that if you reach up here, you may only get here, but that's a heck of a lot better than having this. I got to tell you, for a salesperson, it's much harder on a given month to sell eight than it is to sell 20. And for a manager and a dealer, it is much harder to sell a small amount than a high amount. You see, if you're doing things right with a higher expectation, you have more fun, you're making more productive effort, you're getting more results, and that's what it's all about. I'm Mark Tewart. Make sure you tune in to the rest of this video series. Go to my website, get my free email newsletter. You can call us anytime at 888-2-TOURT, and as always, good selling.